Because we have a registered Volvo ID, what we're able to do is use the same ID to connect the Volvo on-call app on the mobile phone to the car. The first thing you're going to need to do though is to go on to either Google Play, Windows Store or indeed the Apple iStore and go and get the Volvo on-call app and download it onto your phone. What we do then is activate the app and then we go through the login screen using your Volvo ID. This will then bring you to the requirements for Volvo On Call and also the fact that you need to follow step by step the instructions that you see on your phone. One thing to note, you will also need to have your PIN number, which you will get from your dealer for this actual activation. What you do once you meet the requirements for Volvo On Call, you then simply press continue. And therein is a separate terms and conditions for the Volvo On Call service only. These are different terms and conditions that we saw before when we were activating the Volvo ID. To accept these, you literally press accept, and then there are step-by-step -step instructions that you need to perform to register the phone and the car together. The first thing you'll need to do is have the registration number of your car available, together with um, a PIN code, and also you need to sit in the driver's seat and have that connection available. Once you've met all these conditions, simply press continue. And then you need to enter your registration number, select the country that you live in, and indeed then enter your Volvo on-call PIN number that you received from the dealer. Now we've entered that information, simply select continue. And now what we need to do is follow the step-by-step -step instructions on the phone screen. You now need to press the on-call button, which is in the roof area of the car, and hold it there for two seconds. You will now see that you have on your phone a tick that says done. Simply now push the done button at the top right hand side of the screen and now your Volvo on-call app is activated and it's loading. The one thing to remember here is when you are asked for the password, this is your Volvo ID password, not the PIN number that you supplied earlier. Once you've entered your Volvo ID password, simply click login and now the application will start with your information and will be connected to the car.